G'day and welcome back to 7 Days to Die. It's the morning of day 29, the start of week 5. And this week the goals are to get the get an actual base up and running. That would be that would be brilliant if we could manage to do that. Um other than that, I don't really have any other goals. I just I just want to I I hate living like this. Um, and I have an idea in my head of how I want the base to look. It's just, yeah, trying to get it done. Um, okay, so as you may remember, I was talking about um, lifting up the floor. Um, whereas what I think I'm actually going to do is just remove the bars and move the bars up one floor. And we're going to continue this... Uh, inner slope that we have of this uh, concave so it's going to go up two blocks instead um, one of the reasons for that is it's going to narrow down the uh, the bars like the area that we have in here because I found um, in the last horde um, that we that we fought uh, yesterday's horde um, because the uh, cops were able to see us from really far away, they were actually shooting at us from over there rather than coming in under here and getting tied up in the in the barbed wire. So if we can cut that, uh, cut the visibility down, then uh, we're going to be a lot safer off. We, we don't actually need to shoot out there. Like, the, we don't need to see out there. Because all the zombies are going to come in here. So if we can just limit the visibility to in here, it'll make it a lot better for us. So we've got uh, plenty of concrete, um, which is not in there. That's right, I did organization, didn't I? Where the fuck did I put it? There it is. Okay. Yeah, we've got a bunch of that going. Um, just let me get my head around everything. Because it has been uh, a number of days since I played last. Okay. So should I just take these out? Do it now. All right, this is this is going to take too long. All right, I am going to go into creative mode. Uh, allow dev blocks and give myself a hammer of God. And we'll go out of creative mode. Okay, so um, basically I think this is dumb that um, we can't destroy our blocks um, extremely quickly. It, just, it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. So I'm going to use a dev tool to just quickly destroy all this stuff. If you think it's cheating, then I apologize, but I'm going to stick with it. This is going to save me a lot of time and it means we can get more done in the episode. And I'm, I'm only using it on the stuff that I've built anyway. It's not like I'm mining with it or I'm demolishing uh, a POI with it. Alright, uh, actually we could probably use these, right? These probably have a... Yeah, there we go. They've got the same shape. Uh, on face. Yeah. That's a screamer. Where's that bitch? I heard her. There she is. Shut her up real quick. I 
I think the, the screamers spawn far too often, in my opinion. It's crazy. Alright, so we wanna we wanna bulk this up. Okay, so we want to go on face again. Now I'm thinking, what if we do some hatches in these corners? And then that way we could actually throw grenades down there or something. So I might leave those spots free. And we'll just see how it looks. Yeah, so that means we've only got, or if we put hatches there, it's only three by five. So it's a very small window, but because of the angle of all the slopes, we, we should be able to see fairly decently, like right out to here, hopefully. Um, and if we get right on the edge, we could probably see out there if we need to. Uh, yeah, so should be should be pretty good Might cancel this one for now because I want to get some uh, more wet concrete blocks being made So we're gonna need more than that So let's cancel that Let's get um, maybe 200 of these being made and then We'll continue on with the concrete after that Alright, so that's looking good. Um, next, we're going to need... Let's do the hatches, and then we'll do the um, wooden bars. So, let's have a look. Hatch. I'm going to go with wooden ones and then upgrade them, because the wooden ones are easier to see which um, way they're facing. Their... Um, orientation No nope. What to do advanced Okay, so we want to go yeah this way here for these ones Then we want to spin it around 180 degrees for these ones here. So then that way, when they open up, they open up flat against that wall, leaving this all open for us to throw grenades and shit through. All right, so let's upgrade those.
Okay, cool. So that's that. Let's do uh, the wooden bars, which we're going to need some more. Uh, actually, let's like make, let's make a few of them because we're going to have to make the cage again as well. Uh, but for now, I, I just want to get this down. Uh, can we do on face with this one? No, it's going to be weird. Ah, uh, we can do that though. Um, so the reason why I'm using wooden bars and then upgrading them is um, just purely for the fact that the bars are really difficult to place and it's very easy to misplace them. And um, if it's a wooden bar, then you can just hack it down with um, like a, a pickaxe or whatever. And you only lose out on a little bit of wood. But if it's an iron bar, you miss out on quite a lot of iron. Um, and yeah, it takes ages to, to knock them down. All right, that looks good. Um, the cops are still going to be able to see us from quite far away. That that area back there is not very well lit up. This isn't too bad. I think we'll be I'll be okay with that. But yeah, this section here, I might need to like drop that ceiling down a little bit in in that archway. Let's drop it down one more block. Um, that might help us out. Yeah, but this is really good. I'm happy with that. Um, alright. So, let's, let's get rid of those two. Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of these as well. Because it'll actually be better to just replace them with... Uh, we'll leave that for now. I know I want this all the same height, so we're going to beef all of this up. Okay, so I want... Um... Alright, here's what I'm thinking. A bar here. Door here. Oh my god, you killed a fucking rabbit! You brutal bastard! <laughs> wow! Oh, well, I guess can't let him go to waste. And there. Um, and then we could do, yeah, we could do a solid wall there and then have this slope back in for the, for the door into the actual base. So something like that. And then, yeah, there'll be a door there going into the base. We'll do the same on this side, I guess. Um, we could have, like, a garden or something on this side. Okay, now I know you... 
it's probably difficult to see what the fuck is going on, but um, I'm, I'm pretty confident with this. I think we can spend the concrete on this. I'm pretty happy with that. I think that's going to be a good layout. Gives us uh, quite a bit of room over here as well that we can stand sort of out of the way, out of the line of sight. Um, and it, same with these uh, little cavities here where the door's going to be. So yeah, it's not, it's not bad. Okay, so let's get back up here. Um, we're actually going to need more, more wooden bars. Let's make another 30, I think. Um, we want to go... On face this time? No. <laughs> there we go, that's the way I want them. Awesome. Okay. Um, doors. We want uh, iron doors. Ten forged iron. We want four of them. Essentially. Um, also, I'm not 100% sure what we're going to do with that. is that? Oh, it's a pig. What's with all the wildlife? Guess it's better than screamers. Oh, we need forged iron, actual forged iron to upgrade them. I thought we just needed scrap, scrap iron. All right, let's turn the light on. Um, all right, so, uh, seeing as we have these pillars extending out, I would actually like to extend the, our um, balcony out as well to span across this. So let's do that. And I'm going to have to remove that ladder and move it to a better place. So let's make some ladders. Like 10, I guess. That should be enough. Okay, we've got our doors. Um... One there, and one there. Okay, so the middle of this. Is that block there? Okay. That's the wrong block to me, you dickhead. Um, now I think we can only go down four blocks with these, to be honest. I think if we go down a fifth block, 
They'll collapse. Um, so, if that's the case... I wonder if that would give us enough. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that'll that'll do it. Alright, cool. Happy with that. that would look like can we yeah let's do this uh on face yes perfect perfect Yeah, that looks cool. I like that. It's a neat shape. Man, I'm getting carried away on the design now. <laughs> I should be building like the actual base. I'm having fun with this. This is cool. I'll probably fill all that in. Um, What could I what could I do with that space in there? Probably nothing, to be honest. Yeah, I think just filling it in would be the best way to go. Actually, where is that? That's right in the middle here. Hmm. Because we could have dart traps up there. And have them connected to in individual um, plates. Like uh, trigger, trigger plates. Pressure plates? Pressure plates, yeah. So they could all, all be along here. Uh, and plus we're going to have the electric fence that runs along here. So they would run up get electrocuted and stuck here on top of this pressure plate and then the dart track to, the dart trap directly above them will start shooting them right in the head that'd be pretty cool mm, we'll yeah i think i might remove these for now but i am gonna block it off um i don't think i'm gonna do the dart, dart traps just yet Holy shit, it's 4am already. Oh my god, alright, I have to end the episode. I got carried away building, sorry guys. I don't even think I was talking for the last like half an hour. Jesus. I apologize. Um, I was just in my element. Oh, I'm Actually, I'm having a lot of fun with this. Because um, this game, like, there's so many different shapes and stuff that you can do. Well, not that fucking block. <laughs> but... In, in here, like, there's so many different shapes that you can use, and, like, you can combine them in ways that you can just... Like, the amount of different, like, shaped bases you can have is is unreal. So, yeah, I've been enjoying this. Um, so, I'm... At the moment, I... In my head, I think I'm making another...
phallic shaped base. <laughs> because I have this idea of having like two bulbous sections at the back here. Um, and then the, the, it's just going to go ex extend out this way. And yeah, it's just, it's going to be another, <laughs> it's going to be another fucking dick. Uh, true, true to my form. All my bases look like dicks. All right. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. As always, don't forget to lead your targets. I'll see you next time.